Cunningham. Hello, Miss Cunningham. How are you doing today? Good. How are you? Doing pretty good. My name is Austin Ray. I'm going to be your uh, nurse this afternoon. I wanted to do a head to toe assessment. I'm also get my hands washed here. All right. Okay. And can I see your uh, arm band real quick? All right. And what was your name, date of birth? Miranda Cunningham, 102282. All right. Perfect. Um, patient displayed visual acuity. They were able to enunciate and hear. So cranial nerves 2, 7, 8, and 10 appear to be intact. And what was your reason for coming in today? 10 and a half plus All right. Do you know where you are? Yes, at the clinic. All right. And do you know the date? Uh, December 3rd, 2015. Okay. Perfect. And let's see. Go ahead and get your temperature here. All right. Let's stick that under your tongue for me. Thank you. I'm going to go ahead and get your radial pulses here. Okay. Please follow for me. 
Alright, good. The glossopharyngeal nerve and the uh, vagus nerve appear to be intact. Uh, could you move your head down, please? And back. Okay, now tilt to the side and the other side. Alright, and turn. And this way. Alright, and then shrug your shoulders. Okay, now, uh, uh, spinal accessory nerve, uh, cranial nerve 11 appears to be intact. And could you now uh, go against my arm? Alright, and this way. And tilt. And this way. Alright, and shrug your shoulders. Okay, everything appears to be normal there. Hair texture seems to be normal, nice and soft, not too thin. Okay, can you tell me if you feel any tenderness on your scalp when I palpate it? Any tenderness there? Mm -hmm. Alright, no tenderness on the scalp, everything appears to be intact. I'm going to check your temporal pulses real fast. Alright, temporal pulses are normal, no bounding, everything is a plus two or two plus. I'm going to fill your sinuses down. Can you tell me if there's any tenderness or anything? Okay, any tenderness here? Mm -mm. And here? Mm -mm. All right, no tenderness on the maxillary or frontal sinuses. And could you clench your teeth for me? All right, cranial nerve five appears to be working. Uh, and close your eyes, and I want you to tell me if you feel a sharp or dull sensation and where you feel it. Okay. Sharp. All right. Okay, and right here. Okay. And right here. Sharp. All right, perfect. Okay, uh, sensation of cranial nerve uh, 5 appears to be normal. Uh, now I'm going to palpate your lymph nodes, okay? We'll start back here, going in a circular motion. Okay. Alright. Alright, could you kind of shrug your shoulder and tilt your head a little bit? Okay, and the other side. Alright, that seems good. No swelling in the lymph nodes or any masses are felt. I'm going to palpate your trachea now. Okay. Alright, everything is symmetrical in the trachea. Uh, no masses were felt. I'm going to listen to your carotid arteries. No turbulent blood, blood, blood flow was heard. Now I'm going to palpate them. Okay. Pulses feel normal, no bounding. Two plus, and what was next? Oh, yeah, the eyebrows. Okay. I'm going to inspect the hair of your eyebrows. Distribution seems normal. The underlying skin appears to be in good health. Everything looks symmetrical. Your eyelashes, the hair also appears to be evenly distributed. Uh, the posture is correct and you were blinking. So uh, the optothalmic nerve or optothalmic branch of the facial nerve is working. <clears throat> this one, All right. Uh, eye color is brown and the sclera are nice and white. Okay. <laughs> the pupils uh, appear to be symmetrical and even, <clears throat> and a nice normal shape. Okay. I'm gonna test your corneal transparency. Okay. All right. And corneal light reflex. Okay. All right. Everything, shape, color looks good. And whoop, God. Mm. All right, and I want you to follow the pen with just your eyes, okay? Try not to move your head. All right, over here and up. Down. Okay. Up. Down. All right, the cranial nerves three, four, and six appear to be functioning properly. Uh, yeah, <laughs> and the direct pupillary response, okay. Consensual reaction and accommodation. Uh, what was after that? Come on now, what was it? Oh okay. yeah, uh, ears, ears, ears. Okay, and let's see here. I'm gonna pull your ears from any masses, okay. 
Alignment and position look good and symmetrical on both sides. Size is normal. Everything looks to be intact. Skin color is good. Uh, external auditory canal. All right. Everything looks good there. No discharge or lesions were seen. And um, tell me uh, if you can hear this. Can you hear that? All right, and this. All right, perfect. And then, what do we do? What do we do? Uh, no, yeah, that was good. Okay. <clears throat> so could you look up for me, please? All right. Okay. Septum looks good. Everything looks symmetrical. Uh, the whatever they're called, the tur turbinates look good. And I want you to close your eyes and tell me what you smell. All right. Coffee. Perfect. So the olfactory nerve is working. Okay. And let's see. The lips. We've got the nice proper color. And could you open your mouth for me, please? Okay. Buccal mucosa looks good. Everything's nice and moist. The gums also look good. No gingivitis, anything like that. Uh, what else is there? Uh, tongue, tongue, tongue. Could you lift up your tongue for me, please? All right. The salivary glands look good. Um, tongue's proper color. And could you move it up and down for me? All right. And side to side. Okay. Uh, tongue. What nerve is that? I forget. Uh, Hypoglossal nerve, that's what it is. Okay, and let me see your teeth real quick. Alright, you got, looks like the proper number, nice and white. Got some good dental hygiene. Uh, proper alignment, looks good. And let's see here. Could you open your mouth for me, please, and say ah? Ah. Uh. Alright, tonsils are good. The uvula is Moving normally, tonsils are in a 2 plus, um, uh, no odor or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> what else is there? I already did a tongue movement. I think that's, I think that's all the mouth. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, what's next? Okay. Oh, yeah. Palpate the arms. All right. feels good, no moisture, anything like that, no deformities noted, skin also seems good. I'm going to inspect your nails now, could you please do this? Okay, the angle of the nail seems normal, no clubbing is noted, the color of the nails also looks good. I'm going to test the capillary refill. Okay. Check your brachial pulse now. All right. Brachial pulse is still normal. No bounding noted. No plus two or two plus. All right. Do the radial pulses one more time. All right. Radial pulses are also uh, normal. No bounding. And there it is. Two plus. Uh, Oh yeah, hand grasp, hand grasp. Could you grasp my fingers, please? All right, and could you push up <coughs> and then down? All right, and it's normal. Let's see. Um, uh, could you do this one, please? With your wrist, okay. And uh, wait, yeah, do this. <laughs> okay, I almost forgot that one. Uh, all right, and could you lift up your shirt for me, please? Go ahead and lie out there a little bit. <laughs> Get nice and comfortable. Okay. Oops. That didn't work. <laughs> that was 
I was trying to do a little trick there and didn't it didn't play out there. Okay, uh, skin color and everything looks good, nice and normal. Uh, no lesions noted. Um, got a few stretch marks, but no scars or anything. Um, thoracic configuration appears to be normal. Uh, muscle development also appears to be normal. Uh, respiratory movements appear with ease uh, and symmetrical. Let's see here. Heart and lungs. Okay. Inspect. What do you say? Just take the stomach and then do it. Oh, really? No. I got this. I got this. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's see here. The depth looks good. Okay. Breast depth. That's what it is. That's what it is. Okay. Let's start with the back. Alright. Take deep, deep breaths for me. Check the breath sounds on the anterior chest and take some more deep breaths, please. Okay. Sound sounded normal, no wheezing or crackles or anything abnormal was heard. Um, heart sounds, okay. Do the, let's see here, heart sounds, heart sounds. Listen to the rate, the rhythm and intensity. Want to start with the aortic, which is the right second intercostal space. Of the sternal board. Okay. All right. And now I'm going to do the pulmonary uh, heart sound. It's just the second intercostal space of the left sternal board. Okay. And Arab's point is the left intercostal space of the no, <laughs> the left third intercostal space on the uh, left sternal border. Okay, and the mitral, the apex of the heart is in the fifth intercostal space of the midclavicular line. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay, I was right. All right. I'm not started. <laughs> Gotta listen to the apex for a minute. Pulse, I listened to it for a minute. Uh, no gallops, uh, rhythm and rate seem normal. Okay. And have you had any problems with constipation or urination lately? No. Okay, perfect. Now I'm going to listen to your bowel sounds. Could you lift your legs up some more? Move this way for you. All right. Lift up your shirt a little bit. I'm going to start in the right upper quadrant. Okay. Now 
how the left upper quadrant. All right, and the left lower quadrant. And the right lower quadrant. All right, now I'm going to listen to your aortic pulse. legs and feet now. Okay. Not feeling any masses or anything abnormal like that. I'm going to fill your dorsal penis pole. At least the one I have the most trouble with. Okay, there it is. Okay. Wow, you're like the first person to actually been able to find that on. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, I can't even find it on myself. <laughs> but, okay. Uh, dorsal pedal pulses feel normal at uh, 2 plus. Uh, pop luteal pulses. Pop -luteal. pop luteal. I'm not the best at pronouncing some of these words. That's okay. Alright, it's still normal. <clears throat> 2 plus 2. Uh, Posterior tibial, I almost forget that one. Alright, it feels normal. Also, uh, two plus. And could you stand up on it, please? Alright, and just walk around a little bit. Alright, posture seems good. Gait seems normal. we got very Ease movements, coordination also seems good. Uh, crap, I'm sorry, but could you please sit back down again? I forgot to check the uh, capillary fluids in your toes. Sorry for making you do all this unnecessary movement. <laughs> all right. Okay, capillary refills all under two seconds, and I forgot to mention the hands were also under two seconds. Okay, uh, temperature felt normal. Um, nail angles of the toes also look good. No clubbing of the toes, uh, no deformities. I feel like I'm forgetting some. Hair distribution of legs, there is none. She shaves her legs. Um, what else is there? Oh, yeah, okay. Now we can stand up. <laughs> okay. And, <laughs> God, you're making me laugh, okay? <laughs> and we already did the walk and all that good stuff. But could you do the kill the toe for me, please? Don't, don't make me demonstrate because I'll fall. <laughs> all right. Seems good. And could you bend over and touch your toes? And feel your spine. Okay. Don't feel any scoliosis. The, the spine seems properly aligned and range of motion also seems good. Now, could you please kick your land out forward and then backwards and then out to the side. <laughs> okay. And then the other leg. Oh my God. <laughs> Don't fall. No, only yeah. drink. And uh, could you please put your legs together and close your eyes? All right, got a little bit of swaying, but nothing abnormal. Um, you can take a seat again. 
I'm going to check the range of motion of your ankles. And could you go in a circle for me, please? All right, and the other way. Okay, and just lift your knees up then a little bit. All right, knees look good. Did the ankles. Got the hips. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, well, palp tell me, I forgot to ask you if you felt any tenderness when I palpated your spine earlier. No. Could you tell me if you feel any tenderness? No, it's <laughs> <laughs> All right, and let's see here. You got the good balance earlier. Um, oh, let's see here. I think that's it. I think we're done. That's good.